we've decided to do something completely different and have starters, main course and dessert all at different restaurants all around Cape Town. For starters, we arrived at the Asian influence restaurant Bow Down, owned by the charming Graham Oldfield and his wife Philippa. Their restaurant trades from Tuesday to Saturday, 6 p.m. to 11 p.m. The vibe is a casual dining experience with a beautifully designed small menu and an Asian flair. We went there for their homemade bao. It's basically like eating a cloud with the fillings of your dreams. We indulged in the spicy Korean chicken bao, miso glazed aubergine bao, and the fresh cucumber salad. Saki paired well with the clean rounded flavors. Mains brought us to the culturally rich athletic club and social. This vibrant space oozes old world elegance. And our favorite part is that you can have a light main and a gourmet cocktail followed by a dance to live jazz. The Greek owner Athos has delved into the sophisticated bar food culture and is a proud collector of vintage sports photography. We ordered the whole sardines with a chili fennel salad char-grilled halloumi with spiced peaches and a classic daiquiri to get us in the mood for a little dance. Mora Gelato is our last stop for dessert. This gelateria evolved from a family-run business. It is now created in South Africa with fresh local ingredients in a traditional Italian way. The difference between ice cream and gelato is that gelato is softer and lighter with a lower cream content. Moro is open most nights until midnight, which is vital if you're stopping for a dance before dessert. Mm. For the ice cream in my hand and the beautiful fest of spirit of Cape Town around me, I hope that you round up your favorite friends and family and join in on this beautiful dining experience.